Well, it's a slow moving storm and and now it's from the storm surge this morning to uh, just a, a flash flooding event here uh, with catastrophic uh, flooding likely here. It is band set up over Wilmington. Uh, this has been over Moorhead City and uh, continues to spin in and around uh, the center of Florence, which is now just north uh, north uh, to the north of Myrtle Beach. Uh, very heavy rain with even isolated tornadoes. A few warnings in effect tonight. This is actually trying to work its way east of Moorhead City as the storm slowly moves east. This whole area will kind of work its way down the coast, get a little break, and then right near Wrightsville Beach where our landfall occurred this morning at 715. Uh, well, that's getting a band of very heavy rain right now, and it's slowly moving there through South Carolina. You see that center of circulation there uh, just north of Myrtle Beach. So the 11 o'clock advisory moving at five miles an hour, wind down 65 miles an hour. I like to see that number go up, and it eventually will. The storm expected to uh, continue to track to the west. Tropical depression by Sunday morning. Well, it's still in South Carolina turning north uh, by Monday and then quickly moving off to the north and northeast uh, by Tuesday, Wednesday in the middle of the week. It is gone. Uh, real time Doppler tonight. We had a few showers and storms across Broward County, but things are pretty quiet right now. The keys uh, about seven, eight o'clock tonight had a few thunderstorms. They have cleared out and uh, except for one lone shower in Marathon. Pretty dry night tonight. Uh, just a few clouds out there. Temperatures are still above 80 degrees dropping into the upper 70s here overnight tonight. Tropical storm Isaac will watch this here over the next few days. The track from the National Hurricane Center uh, falls apart, and degenerates to a wave by Monday. There's a good bit of moisture with this, and as it continues to turn to the north, might see it try to redevelop. We'll watch this closely here, but for right now, we just could see a little increase in moisture.